is day 17 of Vlogmas. Happy Monday. I cannot believe it's already the 17th. We have one week until Christmas. But I've been super productive and I'm just gonna keep doing my best this week to make sure I get as much done as I can each day. It is already noon and I haven't eaten anything yet. I've been so busy just packing and preparing shipping for all of the orders that were placed yesterday, which is fabulous. Thank you so much if you placed an order. I am trying to get those all out right away so that hopefully they will arrive before Christmas. I think they will. But I just wanted to say thank you so much. Um, I also wanted to say that my husband, Glenn, is most definitely not the perfect husband. I didn't want anyone thinking that when I posted about him yesterday. I was super appreciative. He is super helpful at times but he doesn't cook and he doesn't clean. So just thought I'd put that out there. I am gonna gather my things, head out. I'm also gonna make a quick, super fast stop at the mall because I've located an eye product that I haven't been able to for a little while. It was sold out everywhere. So I will gather my things and talk to you later. I have not had a chance to vlog much at all today. I have been really, really busy in the sewing room at my machine and now it is already 6.15. I'm exhausted and I am making a super easy dinner tonight. I am just making some spaghetti with leftover homemade sauce that I popped in the freezer a little while ago. I thought I would just check in while that is on the stove and show you my patiki cowl. I showed this on my last podcast with Eric and I'm really excited about getting back to this. I'm hoping I can do a little bit of knitting tonight, but I feel really, really tired. But I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try to have dinner and kind of perk up a little bit. Maybe I'll make myself a cup of tea. I've just been thinking so much about winter accessories. This is the Patiki Cowl by Aroha Knits actually. And um, I'm about halfway done, so I'd like to get that done. But I think I've been totally inspired by my friends, Meg and Christina. Meg is from Woolen Cookies podcast or Meg's favorites on Instagram. Her last podcast, not her vlogmases, but the actual podcast that she did, she talked a lot about winter hats and she's really got me thinking about casting some on. And I think she was inspired by Christina, who is from the Chelsea Pearls podcast, and she has a yarn shop and some patterns and just beautiful hand-dyed yarn. And she's also been wearing some beautiful hats in a lot of her last podcasts. So between the both of them, I just want to fill up my winter basket of accessories and start casting some on. But I'm trying to be really careful because I've also been really good about sticking to just maybe two to three projects at once. So before I get ahead of myself, I'm really gonna push through, try to finish some stuff, but I'm itching to finish this one and cast on a hat. That's my next knitting project. This is probably going to be my first hat cast on after I finish a little bit more of what I'm currently working on. It is this beautiful Chelsea Lux yarn in the color Cookie Gate. Christina sent me this from the Chelsea Pearls podcast and it's so beautiful. I think it would make the perfect hat. I'm going to use her pattern, which is the road trip in hat. It uses a skein of DK and mohair and I'm really excited about this one. So I'm not gonna cake it up just yet, but this is on a table in my sewing room, just kind of inspiring me to get moving on my other projects so I can cast this one on next. <laughs> 